Six Southeast 58th. Looks like his car is smoking really bad. Looks like a, big, a wild uh, police chase Tuesday morning. Like police arrested three 15-year-olds and a 13-year-old following an armed carjacking in Renton and police pursuit that ended in Bellevue Tuesday. And just last Thursday, five teen boys, three 15-year-olds, and a 14 and 13-year-old were arrested for a strong-arm robbery in Ballard captured after allegedly leading police on a chase that ended at the commons in federal way. Despite what seems like a growing trend in crimes conduced by kids, Casey McNurthney with the King County Prosecuting Office says that's not the case. The data overall is positive, but these high profile incidents are concerning. I think we, just like everybody in the public, look and say, well, what's happening here, but what we're doing about it is going before judges and taking that information from police to say, this is why- According to McNurthney, to the total number of juvenile crimes referred to the prosecutor's office between 1998 and 2021 dropped 91%. The number of referrals from police for violent crimes, which includes first degree robbery, went down by 68% during that same time period. And the teen who was in court today, his next court appearance will be next Tuesday. Meanwhile, as for the teens in that Ballard case, their next court appearance will be this Friday. For now, live in Seattle, Brady Wakayama, King 5 News.